that the whole family can enjoy together. C88.3 WPOC HD1 Orlando. 88.7 WMYC HD1 Claremont. Adam Square. Woo woo. Yay. 91.7 WDOC Pearson Crescent City. And on your smartphone or tablet. At cradio.com. <laughs> Look, it even has a little sign. Oh Where those chicken God. follow the signs. Ah. <laughs> Can't believe we're actually here. <laughs> Arrivals, check ins. Wait before you take before I'm gonna take a picture of you. Hold okay. well on, I keep recording. Oh, it's hard to operate two things. All right, ready? Here we go. Okay. Today I finished, I went to casting and it was super fun and I moved in and I'm here. It's crazy to think that I'm working at Disney and I'm starting like all of my training and stuff. So it's been a couple days and we got to do some fun things with um, more of Disney and training us and so I'm going to talk about traditions for a little bit. And traditions is like your orientation that you go to. You go to uh, Disney University and you'll get your name tag and your little Mickey ears and you'll get a special visitor. Uh, some things that we talked about, like came up with to share with you is about the Disney look. They make you dress in business formal or business casual and they said that they're going to check and they really did not check. There was people that didn't have the long enough dresses or they tell you they're going to send you home, but they didn't even check. Um, so don't worry too much about what you're wearing. Um, I definitely wore the same pants like two days in a row. Uh, for traditions, you also get to go to Magic Kingdom and get a tour of it. So make sure you get to wear, like, don't wear heels, first of all. Because who wants to walk around Magic Kingdom in heels? 
and um, they give you like an earpiece to listen to them talking about the different aspects of Magic Kingdom and if you're not standing right next to them you can't hear them even with the earpiece so that's, that's a little hint I'm pretty sure I missed half of what they were talking to us about and the traditions is not your longest day because after that we have more training days and more classes that we have to take before we actually start working which is fun um, so at traditions they also give you what's called your blue ID which gives you access to all the parks uh, which is super exciting uh, I had traditions later in the evening so I thought that I should just go to the parks after I got it done with traditions and we were going to be there for like 30 minutes, so we decided not to go, and it's not... Don't worry about going to the parks whenever you get your blue ID. Like, don't stress yourself out just because you are here and you have your ID. You think you should go, like, right when you get done, because you're going to be here for four months or more if you extend, so you can have, go to the parks whenever you want. I actually went the day after the next day, so... Um, I got my blue ID on Friday and then I went on Saturday. It was fun because I got to spend the entire day in the park and I like watched the fireworks and the parade and it was great. Uh, one of the other classes that we had to take was Welcome to Operations. This is basically just a safety training course. They tell you how to not hurt yourself while you're working. <laughs> That's it's very long. It was like eight hours of just sitting in a classroom listening uh, to safety training. And they'll train you all again in your other classes because it towards your more tor like geared towards your role. So then I went to a custodial core class and I learned how to clean uh, properly and take out a trash can for six hours, I think. I sat in a classroom and learned how to clean. It's great. It's great. Um, also, when you go to these classes, make sure you bring a snack because that is probably the only reason I was able to stay awake in them. Because they are either really early in the morning or they're closer to the evening and you like just want to be done. Uh, and also bring a water bottle. They have water cups, but if you like me and you drink a lot of water, I needed a water bottle, so, but yeah, there is a lot more that goes into all these classes, but I'm not going to get into because you all will find out when you start your programs, so I hope you enjoyed this little talk about traditions and the other classes, um, hope to see you real soon.